Legend of Total here, and today we've got a saving a disaster battle playing as the Warriors of Chaos. Now, he's done the right thing in terms of getting a Shagga spam stack going, but he got caught by four Bretonian armies. Now, you might think, oh yeah, but they look like crap armies, and yeah, some of these arm units are not great, but we're not able to deny enemy reinforcements, so that's going to be a problem. And basically, they could just grind us down, and some of our units aren't exactly in the best of shape. So that bounce of power there could certainly be a problem. Because what they could do is just have like these just melee infantry bog you down and then just have the archers shoot at us. So it's going to be, I don't know, we'll see how we go. So obviously the guy's tried it a few times, hasn't been able to win it. Do the best we can. I would certainly like to use the magic user as much as possible to begin with, just thin them out. I, I could try to waste the enemy ammo, but given how many archers they have, it might be better just to wrap them off the battlefield. Another thing is that it's on large unit scale, which gives us a... Ooh, hang on. Okay. Alright, let me just see what we've got with this wizard here. Ah, uh, he's on foot. Okay. Alright, all three of these are on foot. All will be despoiled. It seems like at the moment the gamble button is bugged. It always gives you the exact same number. Alright. We don't want these guys getting killed. Doesn't matter if the shaggers die, but these guys here we don't want them to die. Um, yeah, stay there. We'll take out this first bunch of forces here. See, I, I don't know if there's going to be like two armies coming from here or there's two armies coming from there. Because there's three reinforcing armies. So we've got to assume that they're going to bring in about 10 units. These are going to bring in 10 units. We knock out the first 10. That'll bring in an additional 5. That'll bring in an additional 5. So on and so forth. Eventually, they'll have 40 from this side. And then no more will come from here. But more will come later. But it could be a good way for us to get them off the battlefield early here. Now, looking at some of this other stuff over here. Let's see what we've got. Does he have his armor? Doesn't look like it. So we can regenerate a little bit. I bring a tempest. Hmm. Plenty of winds. Well, actually, some winds of magic. All right. This is the best I can. Okay. So that's where the Lord comes out from. All right. So bounce of power is probably going to remain in our favor for the majority of the battle, but they're going to grind us down. That's what's going to fuck us up here. Possibly. So these two, just... These three, just wait there for now. Yeah, he's not regenerating. We could... Yeah, we could bring him in. He'll be alright. Also, we don't have the option to withdraw, so you kind of have to win. But it being on large... E sorry, on large unit scale, will actually give us a little bit of an advantage, because we dish out just the same amount of damage... But they won't be able to dish out quite as much. Good. Enemy Lord is wounded. Nice and early. Final transmutation is also much better on this unit scale. That's it. Let's look at about 10 units. Let's get them off the battlefield. Since we don't have a lot of magic, I don't know, maybe it's not a good idea to, to cast right now. Just that's it. Just get them off the battlefield. Don't need to kill them. Just get them off. Let's just focus on winning. And, you know, keeping the army alive. So imagine within the next few days we're going to be getting new save files sent in that are, uh, you know, post-patch. But this one here isn't. It wasn't started post-patch, is what I mean. Just be careful. Because, yeah, final transmutation is okay against cavalry. But then again, so is Shagas. Alright. 
It's good to see that their reinforcements are on Force March. I really like now that they tells you exactly how much you're going to restore. Okay, so if I do that, I'll, I'll overheal. We don't want that. Alright, stand back. So, if we want to take out these archers, the best way to do... Get them off the battlefield quickly. Like, we can break them easily enough by charging into them, but then they just rally. That one they managed to get through. There'll probably be some more guys that will come in over here. Try and keep them hidden for now. This one's not hidden. Try and give them some bit of, bit of rest. And yeah, even though we've got like scaly skin, loads of armor, it's just lots of archers. That's the problem here. You know, if it was the only thing we had to worry about, that's nothing to be concerned about. We've killed off half a stack now, maybe a little bit more. One-eighth of what we need to take out. Come stand over here. Because if anyone comes over here, I don't want them detecting our heroes. I guess it doesn't matter if Sigvol gets detected a bit. He can... He'll be fine. Okay, spread out a, just a little bit. Because normally it's good to get these guys in a, in a blob to fight, because they fight better back-to-back, -back, but against archers, you just need to take, like, each of them need to fight one of them at a time. So, right, here we go. Okay, now might actually be a good time for no. Um, yeah, get him somewhat close. Hopefully you can get a few kills with that. That'd be another good thing to get them into a blob for, but we got to focus on the archers. Like I said, even though they're not armor-piercing, there's just so many of them, and they'll do more damage in their infantry. That is definitely not ideal. We should be able to outrun them, though. Speed 34, spe yeah, we should be able to outrun them. I'll need to send someone over there to get them. Where's their general? Killing that dude would be helpful. It's also, I don't know, I should have mentioned this before, but it's on very hard difficulty. Anyway. Everything's okay to begin with. A little bit more damage and then he can have a... Have a heal. Yeah, so where'd their general go? We need to kill that dude. Like, as soon as possible. Where did they? There he is. At no point now should any Shaggers just be standing around. And at no point should these archers be actually shooting. They should be either be running away from us or in melee. Be very careful with him. Going. Very well, fool. Oh dear. Be 
Protect the wizard. Okay, so that was one of their lords. Try to bring them closer down this way. Stand together. We got, we got that under control there. Also, charging as much as possible with the Shaggots is quite good. Oh, they're gonna come back. Now I've got 30 wins of magic, but we just need to get a good cast. No point wasting it for nothing. Bring them back in over here. Where'd the enemy general go? Did we kill him? Slay every mortal. Move it. It's no good cast. Oh, hang on. Over here might be a good cast. So we're okay at the moment. No serious damage. Alright, you can now get that heal. See, their grinding is down. We're okay at the moment. I wish I could get this guy off the battlefield. You know, it might be a good idea if I run him over here. He just, he just shouldn't be in this area. It's too dangerous for him. That's it. Shoot at Sigvold. And try to get all our shaggots together. Because they'll fight better together. For the chaos gods, all will be hell. Good, they're all focus firing on Sigvold. That's perfect. Not doing any damage to him. Try pull away from them a little bit. Draw them more over here. And I'm totally fine with having Sigvold getting shot at there. They've got like virtually no chance of hitting him. Especially if we zigzag around. Bounce of power is good at the moment. But a lot of these guys are going to run off the battlefield and the last of what's coming are going to be the most dangerous. Shattered, that's good. Cause like they're running pretty low on ammo. I could obviously go into melee with them, but a lot of my shaggers are quite tired now. It would just be better if they're just out of ammo. Good, that's getting a few kills. Meanwhile, Shaggoth's just taking on stragglers. Also a good opportunity to use the magic on them. seemingly paying that much attention to Sigvold. Alright, so far so good, I think. Did I end up killing the enemy general? Yeah, I did. Good.
That's it, just run him off the battlefield. Bouncer power's still good. We know we're doing... Oh, shit, look what happened here. We know we're doing okay if... Ugh, sorry about that. We know we're doing okay if... Um, the bouncer power constantly remains in our favor. Yeah, those Grail Knights are fucking us up there. Like I said, they fight a lot better together. More Grail Knights. These ones here won't be as much of a problem. What happened to the other one? Did it break or die? Did we lose two Shaggers? Might have. We did. We lost two Shaggers. Well, Shaggers are easy enough to replace, but these heroes, they might not be. Would have been really good if uh, Sigvold had his armor so that he could regenerate passively. Yes! I serve the beast. Tremble, mortals. That's it. Bring them back here, have a bit of a heal. My God's call. Shame about those two Shaggers, but I don't think the battle's going too badly at the moment. What are these? More Grail Knights. I'll come charging in there. Yeah, we gotta go charging in. Only needs to activate once on them, and it'll run through the whole whole spell. Sick archers just keep them busy. Problem with that spell, though, uses up a lot of winds of magic. We're starting to run low now. That's why I didn't want to waste too much at the start. And even then, that other spell on tra final transmutation there, I don't know if that was really a good use of it. Just keep them shooting. Shit, we're getting coming here. Real guardians. That's okay. They're actually not as dangerous as Grail Knights. Because they're not anti-large. Just can't get close enough. I bring a tempest. Give us ruin. Chaos sorcerer. Slay every mortal. There's another reason why we want to keep moving back is to get them into big clumps like this. If I could just get a spell on them, it'd do a ton of damage. Okay, that should do that. Okay, luckily that one's not too expensive in cast again. Bounce of power starting to get out of control. All their best units is coming in on us now while we're exhausted. Good. Because that spell doesn't do any damage to our troops, so it's okay to cast it on them. And big mosh pit coming over here. Anything that can just speed up this fight here so we can just plow through them quickly. Especially considering Hippogriff Knights are coming in. Need to be dealt with these just crap. Doesn't look like we're going to get much more Winds of Magic. Everybody needs to descend upon these. Alright, 
Alright, now Siggy needs to go and hide somewhere. Oh shit, Royal Pegasus Knight's there. That one is probably gonna die. Bounce of power starting to slip away. I'll try and get him out of there, but now that they've got him on the ground. Don't know. Oh shit. Don't want this guy to die either. No heroes need to die. It's okay if Shaggers die, but no heroes. Good. He managed to get away. I'll try to like just run him off to the corner of the map or something. Like they're not focusing too much on so be it. now two heroes here. Bounce power moved back in our favor just a little bit. Surely we're at the back end of the battle. Yeah, Siggy, you're done for the battle. And we need six minutes of magic to cast that again. Just ignore them. And someone to stop these archers. God damn, still more coming. I really do want to get this one out of here, but it's kind of t uh, it's kind of tight, and you're going to be spending some time recruiting anyway. You should be able to. There's, is that the army losses? Yeah, it is. Okay, we won. All right, and now we'll just have a look at the situation and see what more we can do to help. I guess. See if he's still in this shit, because I don't know the context of this battle. Shame about the two Shaggers that died, but it could have been a lot worse. Wait, hang on. A lot of their armies are on force... Yeah, these would all be on force march. Running them down is pointless. If we could have denied the enemy's reinforcements by just having, having like, one extra lord nearby, this battle would have gone a lot better. Because even though, like, the archers really didn't get many kills or anything... Not being able to justify sending anyone over there to attack them just because everyone else was dogpiling us allowed them to do quite a bit of damage. Oh man. <laughs> it's not over yet. Uh, I don't know if I could beat this. We're just so worn out. I can't withdraw either. I'll do the best I can. Oh my god. I'll need to set up a trap. The problem is the pistol is. I can't do anything about them. God, why did you just go into ambush stance? <laughs> okay, <coughs> well here's something for us. I'm gonna keep you in reserve for now. Oh, I mean he doesn't hide. Um, I'll put you over here. We'll see if we can lure some over there. Put him in a control group. Basically, I just I don't. Ex uh, then that being said, actually, uh, the pistol is will just get him. Like he's probably gonna die, but let's just try to let's focus on just winning the battle. So obviously we'll run up there. Is it just going to say 7 again? Yeah, that's bugged. Anytime there's a new content update, there's always, like, some new bugs that show up. Quickly try to get in there before the pistol ears show up. So they can't escape right away. Or there are no pistol ears in this force. Oh 
shit, I left him over there. Nope, there were pistol ears. Just gotta get these guys off the battlefield as quickly as possible. Honestly, that balance of power is not too horrendous. God, yeah, you need to hide. Uh-oh, if they discover them there, that is bad. Uh, they're not armor-piercing or anything, but we just can't outrun them. Just get them off the battlefield. That's the way. Alright, we got some winds of magic. We need to make use of that. Uh, yeah, there's no point chasing after them. Uh, we, we can't catch them. They're just going to lure us into a position that's not going to be ideal for us at all. So, rather than focusing on the things that we can't kill, we'll try to focus on things we can kill. And these guys here, we can... I don't know, maybe I'll need to do a final transmutation on them just to get some kills. Because that's what's going to fuck us up here. The pistol is. Kind of want them to shoot at Sigvold. It's at least Sigvold. Got tons of armor. And shield. up to them. It's 18 wins of magic. It's just, that's too much. trying as much as possible. It's hard to dodge the shots, but just do what we can. Did we lose one? Yeah, we've lost this one of the shaggers. Probably the one that was super badly damaged in the first place. I want to save my magic for the infantry blob, because these pistol ears are going to weaken us so much. If we can get in a good uh, Gehenna's Golden Hounds on them, that could just give us the win. Pull them back over here. Bounce of power's not too horrendous. cast in soon, because these are fairly concentrated troops. Move on them. Throw it. That's why Shaggers are so much better than getting like a giant spam. Giant spams have no hope against this. Run, you dogs. Just try to stay loosey goosey. Don't don't just sit around getting shot. Try to move around as much as possible. Some of the shots will miss. That's all we can really hope to do. Because we can't catch up to them. Just draw them over here. So we can spell cast. And don't let them get close to the wizard. Alright, here we go. Nope. Not quite there yet. Alright, that's getting quite a few kills. Cool. And then we're on Force March. Okay. Keep falling back. I want to keep casting spells. Because that's what they're like. They're skirmishing us, and our magic is our way of skirmishing with them. How many kills did he get? 
75. Six wins of magic, not too bad. You stay away from that main force. Oh god, only 200 health left on him. Just have to <laughs> make all these frantic maneuvers. Uh, just to try to get some bounce of power. How are we going? Still only one dead, but we're in really bad shape. That one's out of ammo though, so it's not really super high value. How'd that one do? That one, yeah, it's doing really well. Bounce power is starting to get even. It's all coming down to the wizard here. Charging in here. May not be a good idea, not yet. Just because we're so badly damaged. We can thin them up a lot more. Guys on foot, that's good. And the pistolers are almost out of ammo. Once they're out of ammo, it's going to be a lot less pressure on us. Still got so much winds of magic, we need to use it. Oh shit, I'm at the edge here. How do you go there? It's getting a few kills. Luckily they're shooting at Siggy. Okay, charge on in. And I reckon with the big clump in there, the magic will be quite useful. I'm not going to worry too much about the archers. They're in the forest, so a lot of those shots are going to get hit by trees. Or they're going to hit the trees, I mean. Try to inflict as much damage as possible. Just try to nuke him. And yeah, definitely try to kill that general. Watch out for the fucking archers. Looks like we're winning, but now it's just a matter of how much damage are we going to end up taking. God, this guy here is nearly dead. Oh, no, 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 oh, no, no, no. Still only lost one. Yeah, in this battle. Siggy's okay. Alright, looks like we got rid of that Lord. Cool. And... There's the army losses. <laughs> we better not get attacked again. Let him go. Another heroic victory. God damn. What I'm most concerned about, right? People will see like Shagger spam be like, uh, no problem. Why you always pick the easy ones? <laughs> it's, it's, yeah, it's, I had to deal with seven armies.
Let's see if we get attacked again. Oh my god! <laughs> okay, this one doesn't look that bad. Oh my god! Eight armies! So yeah, we're definitely going to need to make use of the magic, obviously. Oh, the end turn that just keeps on giving. Alright, that balance of power seems way more generous than what it gave us in the order resolver, but... Um, oh god, um... At least he'll be able to heal right, right away, that's, that's helpful. And the guy, he's not on horseback, is he? No, okay. Wizards got 34 speed, their fastest unit's 34 speed, okay. Just try to thin them out a little bit before we go charging in. I'll use that after on my first cast. In fact, I'd say the bounce power is actually in our favor there. But sometimes just take that with a, with a pinch of salt. So, I want to get them shooting at Siggy, so they just stand still. And try to clump up their archers as much as possible by just sort of chasing them down this way. And this is why it's important that in every battle, you do the best you possibly can. Try not to make sure you take much damage, because if we had in the first battle, just been like, yeah, we got this, and lost like most of our Shagas, we wouldn't have beat Middenland, right? And if in the Middenland fight we weren't trying to dodge all those shots as much as possible, we wouldn't be able to handle this one. And thank you knows there could be another one after this. Okay, got an idea. You guys start moving around over this way. Want to try to... Actually, you know what? This one's going around the side. We'll do a Shagath sandwich, motherfucker. Alright, how many kills you got? 42. Yeah, kind of a loose mission. They say not... Oh man, if they focused on him, we'd, he'd be dead. Let's split them up. We don't actually want to fight their spear, we want to get rid of their archers first, so we're going to isolate them. Nice big cluster here, like I said, this is what I wanted them to do. AI is awful at skirmishing. So whenever I see lots of missile units in the enemy army, I'm usually not even too concerned about it, because I just know how to deal with it. Because the enemy don't. You play into the enemy's weaknesses, not their strengths. The enemy's strengths are melee. Melee infantry. Well, sort of. I mean, you can trick them as well. That didn't really go where I wanted it to. But we can cast again. Could use a final transmutation, but Siggy's not really taking much damage, it's okay. Wanna just charge in? Yeah, what if what if we have another enemy to fight at the end of this one? Alright, I will use final transmutation now. Also, that's another thing, you're getting closer for that. Actually, this wouldn't be too bad. I'm gonna do that. Alright. Now, we avoid the spearmen, because there's no priority in killing them. And we have the shaggers just go after the archers, which are now isolated. 
Might lose a Shagath or two, but they're this badly damaged, what can you do? Break apart an, an army, bit at a time. Usually by unit type. Get rid of their archers first, then their melee infantry. Because this is the legs of their army. Without their legs, this will just flail about. Get him off the battlefield. It's a good thing you had this wizard in the army. As much as I'm not really a big fan of uh, metal magic, fire magic would have been better. But still, without him, we, we wouldn't have gotten this far. Focus on getting rid of these ones here first. And these ones will be easy because if we get into a big cluster, we just pop down another Gehenna's Golden Hound, they'll just get rid of them. Because these have really low DPS. Alright, get all our guys together. Aim for their general. Hopefully, these guys will crowd around. Pop down a couple more spells, and then hopefully, that just be the end of it. Might even get through this without losing any shagats. Ah, oh, good, another win. There we go, no Shagath died this day. So every army that gets sent at us keeps getting weaker and weaker. I just hope that there's no more to come. I think you're pushing a little bit too hard into Altdorf here. Alright, that'll do. Close victory this time. Interesting. Because I think we barely took any damage. It's like, are we done yet? You know? Is this it? You could make that deal in, in your own turn if, if that's what you really want. Alright, we got through it. Holy crap. So, Sigvald managed to get some replenishments, so... Let's have a look here. You can replace these units in two turns. He definitely earned some rest after that. And got him to level 20. I'm looking at Kolak. I'm assuming you started with Archeon. Let me get, let me have a look. Yeah, you did. 
And, uh, okay. Honestly, you could very easily do a lot of cleanup over here. Be good, good opportunity to get them some more levels up as well. Um, everything seems like it'll be okay, because this will just be, it's always be easy now. Anyway, guys, that's the end of this one. That was a hell of a, <laughs> hell of a ride, but anyway, that's the end of it. So, uh, like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time, fuckers.